Matt Jacobs will be operational section chief. Boots on the ground and the sound of search and rescue teams from 18 counties across the state, all coming together to help when Cal OES calls for law enforcement mutual aid. This is how we document this and we figure out how we're going to search and how we're going to find this person. Navigating rugged terrain and high elevation in Tuolumne County, search and rescue teams are deployed to help locate a missing person. Cal OES's Mobile Incident Command Post provides a central location for search and rescue teams to coordinate together. But just like everybody, they become fatigued, they have jobs, so the numbers might dwindle, and that's where we come in. Regions now, where did we think this might have happened? But before they hit the field, searchers undergo training, including with the latest technology. When I first started, um, it was paper maps and a compass and um, highlighting on the map of where you're, you're going to look. Through the use of mobile phones and the Caltopo app, you not only see the other assignments around you, but you can see all the different resources in the field. We're going to go this way. In real time. We're going to try and follow this trail and see if we can... It also teach them about how to brief out and how to give good briefings and, and, and good missing person flyers and an incident action plan that you put together and you hand out to your search and rescue teams. It's the best way to organize a search. Utilizing the techniques they've learned in the classroom, California search and rescue volunteers can now use those techniques out in the field in real life scenarios. The best way to describe what we do is what the sheriff needs. He, if he doesn't have something, we get that for him. So if it was an aircraft, or if it was extra searchers, or the command post that we brought, it's a neighbor helping neighbor type of situation because next month we all might be going to El Dorado or next month we might be going to Sacramento. So we, it's a constant neighbor helping neighbor and that's the mutual aid. Whether you find the person or you're there finding where the person isn't or you're supporting that team, uh, it doesn't matter. You're all really doing the same thing, common purpose. To help save lives. To see more from us, visit news.caloes.ca.gov and follow us on all our social media channels.